Ask me about no other time. Yeah, let's talk about Webby then. Let's talk about when Webby checked you. Know your pussy bar, but I was still Neither wondering. Do you got a problem? Oh, you got Cause a you can get exposed. Yeah. Hope you got your head up. Okay. <laughs> 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 but look, all right, so. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Tell me about the, uh, the run-in with Fredo Bangs and uh, Lil Webby. Okay, so... This nigga. <laughs> so Miami, I went to uh yeah, I went to Miami. Ronnie and Fredo Bang did a feature, Pine shot the video. It's called Doggy, go check that out. We was in Miami, had a, a nice crib, females came through. And um that was my first time meeting him in person. He was cool. It wasn't really too much of an exchange and then I took a picture with him there. The second time I went to Miami in Channing, she signed a Gucci man. And uh, she was in the studio with Fredo Bain. I pulled up to Miami. I was really pulling up on Enchanted. He in the studio. So then when I got there, like I said, it's my second time in Miami. My first time I seen Fredo. The second time I pulled up right to the studio, I see Fredo. So I'm like, bruh, every time I'm in Miami, I see you. And he like, bruh, every time, he damn near like, every time I'm with somebody from Texas, I see you. And it's like. Oh, and, and not in a good way. Nah, it wasn't a good way. Oh, okay. But so it, that's just like how. We communicate, but we start talking, chopping it up. Like I said, I, I didn't want to play him no music, and I didn't want to ask him for no picture this time. The first time at the video shoot, it was a video shoot, so I seen my way in to do that. We in the studio session, and we all just talking, and it's not that type of time, so I didn't want to take no picture. I didn't. I'm like, damn, I'm in the studio with Fredo Bang, but I ain't really got nowhere to prove it for real, and it's like, fuck all that. So I'm just chilling. She come sit by me, he come talk to me, talk to me. I was then went by. He playing his music. I was then went by. I'm talking about all night. And then in my mind, I'm like, damn, I should have got my picture. I should have got some videos. I should have got, I should have played him some music because I was trying to hold back, and that nigga laid it all out on me, like, and he was talking about life, talking, 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 playing everything in his catalog. That nigga played me so many songs. I'm like, damn, bro, how do you? I was mad that I couldn't play that many songs. I'm like, bro, I know I got more time than you. How the, how you got more songs than me? Like, it, it, it sent me somewhere. Like, I was like, damn. That nigga really motivated me, inspired me on some shit. Let's talk about um, Yellow Beezy. Yellow Bees and you y'all. Right, we gonna talk about him But you said Fredo And then Webby. Webby Webby I talked about Fredo I ain't talk about okay, Webby Okay yeah yeah You right You right I didn't even hear you on I thought you and Webby I thought you didn't want to talk about Webby Because Boosie Pretty much had already Kind of ran you out of a situation before And you nah, know They kind of Then they called me back We ain't get to talk about <laughs> <laughs> We ain't get to talk about The second show And they say Call that same dude Back to perform oh, And I performed And I rocked You it. didn't bring that up Yeah Oh cause he we, started Cutting no, up No 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 now. Look you asked me about the time I almost got jumped. So, yeah. They asked me about no other time. Yeah, let's talk about Webby then. Let's talk about when Webby checked you. Know your pussy bar, but I was still yeah, wondering. Cause you can get exposed. Yeah. Hope you got your head up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but look, all right, so shout out to DJ T. Gutter from St. Louis. That's his DJ. He go around with him everywhere he go. <laughs> so they came to Fort Worth. They had a show in Fort Worth. He texts me like, man, I'm at the hotel. Come see me. Woody, woody, woo. And man, I know you, you know, bring me some smoke or something, man. I know you be smoking good. So I put up on them. I get in the room and they got a double bed and Webby in the room and he in the room too. But Webby really just stand off and she's not really saying nothing to me. He really uncomfortable that I'm in there, in their room. And I understand that too. Mm -hmm. Kind of was the same like the booze situation. Like, what the fuck is this nigga doing in our room, G? So I come in there, I felt this vibe. I dap the DJ up. I left some smoke for him. I ain't charge him with nothing. I just put it on the table. Good seeing you. And I left because I felt very vibe. I think I asked about a feature too. I said, how much for the features? He was, I ain't doing no features. That's probably the only thing he said. And I asked the DJ how much he charged for features. He answered, like, I ain't doing no features. I'm like, oh, all right. So then I left. The next day, he texts me like, man, Savage wants some of that that you gave me. I'm like that was all that was that was yeah, all part of the you, plan. That's how you do. I know what you were getting. I already knew if that was all like part that. of the plan. Coming like that. So I I pulled up to the room. Now they all in the sprinter in the parking lot. Like don't come in the room this time. Yeah, they all in the sprinter, which is cool. It's a personal I, space. I, I I get that. So I wouldn't walk in the room though. Dude invited me to the room. I still wouldn't walk in the room. All right, whatever. Here we go. <laughs> 
Hey, no, I don't hear you go. I just I know how people feel. This is a well, well, I'm supposed to get in the smoke in the lobby. I'm supposed to get in the smoke in the parking yeah, lot. I mean, I'm supposed to. Well, how I'm supposed to do that, bro? Y'all yeah. gotta figure that way. In the car, I don't rock like that. We gotta be in the room, private I, space. I, I understand. Y'all wanna I, I smoke? That ain't got nothing to do with me. I'm yeah. coming in this room to do what you call me for. Okay, and, and you. when you when when you come back the second day, but they come told you, the you can't time. come in the room. So now I pulled up next to the Sprinter. So when I pull up next to the Sprinter, I hop out. I'm finna give it to him for free. I'm forget him. I'm forget to him for free. A big old bag. I hand it to him. He jump out the car with a hundred dollar bill. Matter of fact, no, no, no. I asked him for a picture. I'm really finna give him this for the picture, bro. Yeah. I'm like, can I take a picture with you, bro? He like, yeah, come on, come on. He finna get up out. Then he just changed his mind in like, in 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 a split second. That's and, him. And I'm like, dang. All right, then he pulled a hundred dollars out of his pocket and gave it to me like, like nigga, you ain't gotta give me that for free. Like, here, I'm gone by my business. Then he said right before he pulled off, he was like, I got a show tonight. If you want to come to the show, come thug in a section. We could take as many pictures as you want. It really came off like like on some fans. You're like, yeah. since you want to take pictures, old picture taking that nigga. Come to the show. We're gonna be in VIP. We're gonna be popping bottles and taking pictures. Come get your picture tonight. Hey, he felt your vibe. I know how we be. He felt your vibe, bro. I understand. I, I what what do you feel on times. this vibe? Good. What's my vibe? Man, yeah. you're, like, you're like, you gotta understand when, when, when Webby, it's like, he, Webby's like, <laughs> like he, he like selfish a little bit. So okay. it's like when you first meet him, it's like, like you say, he's standoffish. He want, he want to, he want to see who he is. He probably to ask my other DJ who you is like that when you left. Okay. He probably did that. Okay. And then when you came back next time, that was your smoke was good. He liked that. So he wanted to see who you was again. So the way he called you back again. Because they could have called somebody else. Okay. He called you. Okay. To see but what your vibe was. Well, my vibe was off at. You had, it wasn't off. Okay. He was just, he was just uh, monitoring your vibe. Just checking, yeah. Nah, he, it wasn't off. He was just getting, because I do the same thing. Mm. I give you a hard time before I meet you, but I see you cool. I see you moving around. Then why he didn't take no picture with him? He's like, nah. He, he, yeah, why he changed his mind about the picture? What did he tell him? What, what did he okay. tell him after that? All right, so What boom. did he tell him after that? He felt so, your vibe was good, so he told you, come on. At first he said, we could take pictures all night, and then I just left. And I told bro, like, it's all good. I want no picture. I'm not coming to that show for no picture. So boom, boom, boom. He really hit me after that. Like, bro, they be talking about him on the internet, and they be talking about him in the comments. And he ain't had no shirt on. He ain't had no clothes on. He ain't want to take no picture with you because he don't be liking the backlash that he get because that was during the time where he was getting a lot of backlash yeah. when people were seeing him in, in the streets. So it, well, was, understandable. So it was understandable. Yeah, first... It was understandable. It was understandable. And even me, I'm looking at it like, dang, because he had no shirt on, so he was like he wasn't dressed right. But see, like, I'm from New Orleans, bro. Like, like... When we start caring about how we he dress, he probably done too. So it's like, it's like. But he, when we start caring about how we look, or, we don't. So that's what I'm saying. He don't. It's All just right. like you're saying. He don't want the backlash. When we start caring about what people are saying about us, we don't. All right, we don't. That's why I say I don't really got no problem with. It. I understand it, bro. I understand it. That show sure don't care what you say about me. Well, you know, my thing is, man. You know, y'all all from Louisiana, so. You know, at the end of the day, I don't know what y'all do down there, but I, you right. know, we don't care. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah evidently like you do because Webby did. Now y'all nah, can say what you want to say. That was nigga check y'all on that. That nigga didn't want to do it. So yeah. yeah, let's be real about that for a minute. I'm, I'm with that. He didn't want to do it. But I'm he with didn't that. I'm with that. I'm with that. That's like juvenile, bro. I was backstage. I was backstage. I didn't want to take a picture. What is wrong with you, my nigga? I ain't want no picture with Juvie, bro. I was backstage at a Miska show, my cousin Miska, and I was backstage. Miska and Juvie seen each other. They they speaking to each other, then they really get to look at that. We like, man, who this nigga is backstage? Get this nigga from back here. I'm back here with my cousin. Like, like he back here, just like him and all his people back here, and you and all your people back here. We back here. He down there like like telling my cuz, like, you good, but these niggas gotta go. I'm sitting there like, no, we not, bro. We not leaving him. We going everywhere he going. See, you cocky with it. You I'm not, said, I'm hey, not, bro. I'm not, I'm not. He got a show. Cousin, bro, they both book. It ain't both. Cocky, they bro. shared that room, bro. All you bro. had to exactly. say was, hey, man, that's my cousin, bro. We just hanging out. Instead, you, nah, we not moving. You know, you got, you know I mean? I, bro, that's how we that's, that's not good, bro. That's how we that, you, I ain't you even say it like that. I'm just telling you, you how I feel. I'm just telling you how I feel. I'm just telling you how I feel. How did you say it? I ain't say nothing, but I wasn't moving. See, you should have said something. You should say, hey, man, that's my cousin. Just here, you know. 
Who is you talking to? What did you talk about? <laughs> bro. You niggas is too hard, no man. Shit like that, bro. Y'all too Stop hard, Stop talking to bro. me. Do your show. You here? Why you worry about me? See what I mean? <laughs> niggas is hard, man. You do your show, it's old school. They See, that's crazy. You young niggas crazy, man. Yeah, yeah, y'all niggas don't give a damn. Listen, stand up for yourself, bro. Wherever you go, you thought you got to talk, say something, say something, bro. I ain't say nothing. All I'm saying, I'm gonna say something. I ain't say nothing. I just went going nowhere.